Hey, um, happy spring day. It's the 1st of September today. So happy spring. Uh, tomorrow morning, I'm going to go on an early morning mission. There's a whale that's washed up on the beach uh, two towns away. And I want to go film it or take some pictures with some friends. Uh, I'm not really into filming dead things or devastation. But I really have been missing using my camera and making any videos. So the other thing that I would really like to accomplish is to use my X-H1 for the stills and for the better part of the video. My GoPro, my Mavic, and if I really can get the time, because there's a lot to carry, to use the Zeon Crane uh, for a bit of gimbal shots. I guess the thing would be just to have a little bit of practice of using everything and then putting it into... I'm really just working with story. So the story is, going to see a whale. Want to use all my kit? want to turn the intention is wanting to turn make something that's really sad and find the beauty of it so yeah let's see if we can pull it off bye So let's get this GoPro. So it's really early and I can now make a little bit of a noise. But uh, got a f about 70 kilometers to drive and uh, it's way before sunrise. And yeah, I'm gonna time lapse a little bit of the road and I might even talk a little bit to the camera and see how we go. Uh, but yeah, I always love getting up early in the morning. I uh, love basically being up before the sunrise and being in my car, listening to my lectures and getting there before the light and never knowing what I'm gonna get. So I hope this composition is all right. I don't know what it's gonna look like because I can't really look behind the lens, but uh, yeah, we'll be there in about half an hour. Okay guys, so we're here, uh, I'm here first, it's a little bit cloudy as you can see, um, trying to get some better light on my face, not much light here, um, but yeah, I can't see the whale as yet, uh, got all my kit with me, um, and yeah, hope we'll get light soon and uh, hope we'll get some good shots. So see you when we get down there. So I can actually see the whale it's quite far down there. Uh, so I'm gonna start walking and guess I will meet the guys there. there definitely can smell it and yeah I'm kind of thinking of shots like I'd love to do a shot a vertical shot with the drone um, the water washing around it also I'd like to get a shot of the space Kerikus point with the whale in front of it Uh, 
Uh, the smell is quite intense. Oh, Woo. I've been shooting some long exposures. I've got a variable ND filter on the lens so that I can shoot up to five second exposures. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a little bit more going around, getting some close up long exposures. And my feet are wet. The sand is quite oily from the blubber. And I think, uh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna put the drone up in the sky and probably get some vertical long exposure shots as well. Um, so I guess the, I've filmed this a little bit and I've taken some photographs and I'm sure some of those photographs will be good, but what's the story behind it? Um, the story is every year we see whales wash up on our shores. Uh, most of the time the whales die of unnatural causes, uh, plastic, plastic in the ocean. Um, and that's kind of sad, you know. Um, such a beautiful creature, and yeah, I guess I I feel a bit sad. And um, but yeah, it's felt good to make the mission and come and see it, and to make this little video. I'm gonna probably head back now for breakfast, and then I have some other stuff to do for the day. But yeah, thank you for joining me on this adventure. It's just going to be a short little clip and uh, yeah, think about the plastic you use and think about where it goes and uh, you know I live uh, as best I can, the most sustainable way I can, uh, as little waste as possible. And I guess that's my way of dealing with it is just doing what I can on the level that I live and once I've got that completely waxed perhaps I could help others. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and have a beautiful day. Cheers. at the car um, lots of people arriving now to go see the whale um, apparently it should be quite good for sharks uh, as the blood and the blubber goes into the water the scent the sharks are attracted so that could be really good to see as well but it would be a really good on the high tide um, my hands smell of blood and blubber and my boots I've chucked in the back, they don't smell so good either. But yeah, in general, still feeling sad and but it's always good to make the mission and have a purpose. Get your shots, get your short story, get it online, let people watch and draw an audience, you know. So thanks for watching guys, always appreciate it. Please like it, leave a comment, share it if you feel like it. And uh, ask me about South Africa if you like. Uh, traveled around quite a bit of South Africa. Love my country, love the nature. So if you have any questions, feel free to ask. Later.